So how does it feel to be the national champion? It feels amazing. Last year I came short, but this year it was mine, so it feels really good. Yeah, because yeah. this is a race you and, you and your brother have been close to winning in the past. So yeah. Does that yeah. make it sweeter to, to get it? Yeah, actually, it's, yeah, it made it sweeter to get it. I feel, I'm really proud of what we did today, yeah. What was your strategy? Uh, it was just to be patient, the whole, like most of the time, until like I feel good enough to go. So I just had to be patient, 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 and let like others do the a lot of work. Yeah. Did you get worried at all? Once they had, she had a Herberg had a 25 second lead on you guys at one point. Uh, I I was not worried at all because I actually watched yesterday's mail says so I was not worried. I 10 k is a really long way, so you have to be like patient the, like most of the time because you cannot do the world by yourself like you kind of depend on other people like we depend on each other so i knew that i i wasn't worried at all i knew that we will just kind of do it anyways at the end yeah and you broke the runner-up forbes you when you passed her it was game over pretty much immediately were you surprised she didn't uh respond at all to, to your move uh, I wasn't really surprised because I kind of like I kind of know my uh, strength, so I know like if I have to go in five laps to go, I can, I can like survive, I can like survive that pace until the end. So I was just like, uh, if it's time to go, it's time to go. So I, and I was like uh, ready for that. So I was just when it was like time to go, it was time to go. Yeah. I noticed you're wearing the um, the vapor flies as well, just like uh, Dylan Jacobs last night. Why did you choose that versus spikes? Okay, so actually, I last year I kind of used the same shoes, so I have been using them for my most of my 10k's because it can, I feel like using the spikes sometimes it can like ruin your hamstrings or something. So I am not like comfortable using the spikes for that long, for like 25 laps. I feel like that's a lot. So I have been like training myself to use these shoes most of my 10k. So I was just comfortable using them. Yeah. Would yeah. you use those for the 5k as well? Probably not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Probably not. How much confidence does this race give you for the 5K on uh, Saturday? Yeah. I know for sure for the 5K is gonna be a little bit challenging because there are some people who, who will be doing the 5K only, so they are kind of fresh coming into the race. Uh, but I am just like, it's gonna be like, uh, I'll just depend on them. Like we're gonna just go there and see what happens. So yeah. What was it like to win your first 10K, the first 10K title in Alabama history? It's amazing. I've been wanting to do this for some time now, so it's just amazing. I'm really happy for what I've done today. I'm just, I'm just happy. Yeah. Were you looking up at the board to see how far behind people were? Mm, sometimes yes, yeah, sometimes no. Yeah. yeah. Because with four laps to go, Grace came back on you just a little. She was only four seconds behind. Were yeah. you aware? Uh, yeah, I kind of, they kind of told me that. So I was, I was just ready for that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can we get a picture with you and Greg? Okay.